All right. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go with y'all. I'm gonna go with homemade tea gray because that's the one that's special to me. <laughs> Midsummer's dream of hombre tea gray. For your amazing support, everyone! It's me, Ombre Tigre! We love you, Ombre Tigre! You rock, Super Australia! Oh, can I get a picture of us together? Put one arm around me and let's uh, form a heart with our hands! <laughs> Perfect! Uh, uh, hi, can I get your autograph? Whoa! Did you just hug me? With your sweaty body? I, I must be dreaming. I'll never shower again, ever again! I'll talk to him later. Amigo? hour. <clears throat> Five more minutes. Hombre Tigre? <clears throat> oh no. Long time no see, amigo! <laughs> Woohoo! God, that was horrible. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, wait, Tigre? That's right! It's your favorite Super Australia! Oh, wait, Tigre! At your service! I'm so glad you're here! Welcome once again to the Dragon Palace! Otihime helped Talos and Hephaestus rebuild this virtual resort from a workshop in Tokyo! I know it's the middle of the night, but I just had to invite you as soon as I heard the news! Welcome to the Dragon Palace! I see there are two of you today! Let us know when you would like to leave. Until then... Please enjoy your stay. You heard him, amigo! Since time flows differently here, there's no need to worry about tomorrow's schedule! There's no need to worry about fans or paparazzi either. We get the palace all to ourselves! And that's not all. Today, Hombre Tigre is a one-man show! That means you get me all to yourself! Mwah! You're giving off a different energy. 
You think so? Well, there could only be one explanation. You're looking at me differently than you usually do. Now it's the moment you've been waiting for! Fan service time! One on one! Um... Um... Uh, um... Um... <laughs> I've been training for this day, so I can make whatever extreme wish you may, ha you may have come true! Hmm. Um... Uh... Hey, uh, Brendan. Can I ask you a question? Oh, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, go ahead. Shoot. But really... We're on a once-in-a-lifetime vacation at a magical place, right? So why are we just taking a siesta? I thought we were gonna make a hot, exciting summer memories! At this rate, I'll miss my chance to show off how cool I am! But I already know how cool. I even made a book full of ideas to entertain you! Oh, damn. My body is itching to get some action. How about playing a sport? I'm up for anything as long as it's physical. Come on, amigo! What do you say? <laughs> wow! <laughs> Uh. <laughs> oh. I don't know. What? <sighs> the thing is... I've actually been wanting to say this always when it came to Ombre Tigre. When I found out about his character. <clears throat> thing is... You've been pushing yourself too hard. You to strain yourself. Oh, amigo. I'm sorry. Have you been worried about me all this time? Here I was thinking you didn't like me anymore. I even thought you might be jealous of all the loving fans that surrounded me. That surround me at my matches. Yeah. Let's not talk about that. Uh, um. I'm afraid your fans will take you away. I know of how honest you are, amigo. I'm sorry for smiling, but I'm just so happy! Thinking about you looking at me in the ring like that just makes me... Uh, in serio, gracias. I think I said that right. God, it's been forever since I used Spanish. Just for that, here's a bestio full of my appreciation. Since I had the chance to talk to you, there's a favor I've been mean meaning to ask. Back in the day, there used to be two Super Australias in the now legendary ring. They were rivals who competed against each other and shone in all their glory until, one day, one of them suddenly retired and disappeared. I wonder what that must have felt like. What do you think? I can't 
ask was a coddle. I can't answer that. <laughs> of course not! You're my amigo after all! Sorry for the strange question. Mm -hmm. What's wrong? Did I make you angry again? me why did you do that what were you thinking oh you mean the lucha the other day where I fought with those tigers in Tezcatlipoca's place it isn't it obvious all I could think about was shining as brightly as my super Australia he's the best and brightest in the world so I couldn't let him down I have to always live life to the fullest. It impresses people and keeps their eyes glued on you. That's what being a Super Australia is all about. to be a huge fanboy of a certain Super Australia and cheer him on at all his matches. I dreamed of being his equal in the Lucha Ring one day. What I wouldn't give to be someone like him or be treated as his equal, that's what I thought. In fact, I would have given up anything to make that dream come true. you're always falling apart I learned life can end at any moment that's why it always looks like I'm in a rush I'm constantly anxious about the precious time I have left it's also why I brought us here to live the virtue eh. It's also why it brought us here to the Virtual Dragon Palace, which is disconnected from the natural flow of time. I made you worry along the way, though. We're in the Dragon Palace now. Time doesn't matter here. That's right! Only in this deep ocean where the sun's rays don't reach can I forget about the little time I have left? Don't say that. <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> I'm so glad you're watching over me. You have the eyes of my Super Australia. It's as if he's gazing at me passionately right now through you. I feel myself turning back into that little fanboy. At the same time, you're not him at all. I know you're not him. And I know I'll never be him. I don't think I'll ever let go of my dream, though. One day I'll just disappear from this world altogether. At least in this moment, I want to give you what I can. Dang, I kind of want to go through, I want to repeat this and do like all three options. But, like with Tess, got the poker. <laughs> Whoa, amigo! You caught me off guard! As a luchador, it's embarrassing to let someone get the upper hand on me. Shut up. Wait a minute. 
Can't we talk this out? No. No. Stubborn bastard. I'm not letting it in here. I challenge you to a wrestling match. <laughs> Uh, are you serious? I'll make you say you don't want to die. I'll make you say you can't live without me. Prepare yourself! Oh. oh, I get it. You're challenging me to a mucha! Just like he did all those years ago. <laughs> if you really think you've got it in you, bring it on! I'll take you on any day! <laughs> I love you with all my heart!